The new trailer for Garden of Ban Ban 6 has been released. And obviously, I'm going to recreate it here in Minecraft. You guys commented a lot in the community tab of the channel asking me to do this. So, to start, I'm going to list all the scenes that appear in this trailer so we can make them here in mine. And then, record each character. There are some really cool new characters, like this mutant Nab Nab. So, let's go. The first scene that appears, that one there, is a kind of green room. Looks like a cafeteria. There are some tables and some soda machines. And and then it shows as if there were these little slugs on the floor. I don't know what these creatures are. Well, but let's go. I'm going to create here on the floor with the little axe, this green base. Then I'm going to raise the walls here and leave a space for the door. Something like this. Create another wall here. Done. Now I'm going to start putting in the decorations. Look, it looks like a cafeteria. I'm going to place tables here. We put a table and some chairs. I'll put a soda machine. I think it can be more towards this side here. And here I've set aside to put a door. Just like that. Perfect. The first scene is already more or less ready. Now, we need to make those little creatures that pass here. And to create them, I entered a 3D program called Block Bench. And I recreated them more or less as I think they are, because you can't get a perfect view of them yet since they haven't appeared properly. And now that they're ready, look, I'm going to press to record and I'm going to stop more or less here on the side. A recording will start up there and it's all crooked, weird. I'm just going to walk with it here forward. Its camera from the video will be more or less here. The camera seeing that chair there and following this slug passing. I just need to record with about five more slugs. One of these. And that's it. So I recorded with the others that were missing. And the first scene of the trailer is ready. This one is the original, which is the scene that appears in the Garten trailer. And this is how it turned out in Minecraft. And well, to make the next one, it seems to be kind of an abandoned forest with a house, an old shed in the back. And there, in the middle, there's a road. So that's what I'm gonna do. A road to make this other scene, which is a forest in the shed. I'm going to create it here on the side. I'll probably create all the scenes next to each other so we can see each one at the end. I'm going to create more or less here a base. It will start here and will be quite large. So end here behind. Select here. Just use the command here. And then I created the base. Now for the wall, I'm going to raise a huge wall here on top. The wall will come more or less from this distance here to the other corner. And inside there will be the shed with a lot of trees. I don't know if I'm going to show making all the scenes for you. It froze here. There. Done. Created the wall. Coming here in front, we can get more or less a notion of how it will look. As I said, I'm not going to show creating all the scenes because there are 15. And if I show creating the 15, the video will be, I don't know, an hour long. The important thing is the final result, which is the complete trailer of Garten in Minecraft. Let's go. Now here and then, I created the shed. Similar to what's in the trailer. Just need to put here and here on the other side and done. Now I'm gonna do the following. I've already left some parts of the ground because I'm gonna do this. Look, I'm gonna spread saplings and I'll grow these saplings around the map so they become trees. There's a secret I use. Let me grab the glass here, which is this. Look, if I put glass around it, it has a chance of growing a much bigger and stronger tree. And look, when I put a taller tree with a longer trunk and then I filled it with trees until it looked like a real forest and look how it turned out it turned out very cool the scene itself the original scene it's like this look as you can see and this is how it turned out in mine so now we can go to the third scene that appears in the trailer and the next scene is like our player running away from slugs in a corridor full of stairs and a yellow door so without dragging on too long to not delay let's create here I'm going to add a space where I'll create a kind of white cube. It can be quartz. So now here on top, I'm going to put a roof, make a hole here in the middle, and there are several floors. So to not take too long, I'm going to do the following. I'm going to need some pretty stairs here, which I have in the mod. There are several decoration things here, and then I'm going to make a floor, and I'm also going to put this fence here, which is an industrial iron fence. And here there has to be another floor. To make this other floor, there's a command in Minecraft that's very cool. For example, if I make a construction here, a very simple construction, Construction. Please subscribe to the channel and I come here in the corner to select this construction and give this command here Barra stack 10 for example, it's going to copy subscribe 10 times, but seriously subscribe to the channel We're at 37,000 subscribers. We need about 60,000 more to reach 100,000 I've always wanted to hit 100,000 subscribers on YouTube So please these videos take a lot of work recreating trailers in Minecraft. Well, okay but I'm gonna use this technique here. here I'll select from one side the other and give the same command. But the difference is that now I'll add to copy it upwards. And if I go inside here, look. Now there are the stairs copied several times. It's the same construction I made. But it was copied. Smart, right? To save time, I'm also going to place a lantern here. And I have to make a hole here. Because, as I told you, there's a yellow door. And 
obviously the yellow door can't be missing. I have the model of it here, but it's kind of big, like this next to the doors of Ban Ban. There's always this little button. Now just take this item and here. I have a Garden of Ban Ban controller that I can put in my character's hand. This will serve to make the scene because he's with a red controller in his hand running from the slugs. To record this scene, I'm gonna stop up here and I made a recording with these slugs here on top. Look, so I have to run away from them and running away from them, when I think I finally found an exit, I go down here below and more are coming and then I run and think, wow, this time they won't catch me. And then I run here to the door and that's more or less the scene. I left more or less an example there on the side for you to see the original scene, which is this one of him running in garden and the Minecraft scene turned out this. like We already have three scenes from the trailer, but there are still many to do. So let's go. We have a lot of work ahead. Well, the next scene that appears in the trailer is this one here. Look, in a blue room and it looks like a doctor's room. It has some machines. I created this blue square here and this is where I'm going to make the other scene. The floor, as I noticed there, is a gray color as I showed you. It has like a machine. So I made this one here and it turned out very similar. I just have to increase the size of this room a bit because here to the side is much bigger. Let me break here. I'm going to pull to the side a bit the size of the larger room to fit there on the side. One thing I've also separated is the models I'm going to use. Like cabinets that are there. A doctor's stretcher that is in Ban Ban appears several times. This stretcher, it's this other thing here that is also medical. A red curtain. And as I said, I'm not going to show you making the whole scene because I've already explained that the video can get very long. But in summary, and look, it's ready. It didn't even take two seconds. Just kidding. It took a long time to make this here, but I didn't show you. It turned out very good. As I said, I had opened the space here to the side look, and it worked out just right. The size of the room. This scene will also be simple to make. As you can see in the original scene, the room is more or less like this. The difference is that we walk with a controller in hand here to the side. And yeah, it turned out very similar. With the original garden scene, we already have, I don't know, about five scenes from the trailer. The next one, look, is this kind of green place with some trees and stuff. And suddenly the Tarda bird appears there. Huge. Look at this. How cool. It was the mini Opila from the last game, right? He turned mute. This scene is going to be a bit easier to make, but I had a different idea. Look, we've already done all these here. The first scene, very beautiful. The second as well. Here we have the third, right? Which are the stairs. And now the fourth, which is this blue room. I'm going to stop recording here and I'll go there to make all the remaining scenes from the trailer which are these that you're seeing there there are several I think there are about 15 in total and when I clap my hands all of them will already be ready so three two one and look all the scenes here on the side are ready as I said look there's one more two three four five six seven did you do this so quickly no it wasn't quick. It took about two hours to do everything or more, actually. But let me show you quickly. We're gonna do a few more scenes. I'll show the most important ones. This one here, which is the Opila bird. We need to come here to record with him. Let's go. Something quick. I'm gonna stop here on top. There will be a camera there recording the scene. And then suddenly I'll press to record. And this one is the Tarda bird, the more mutant one. But he's standing still, all unanimated, because later I'm gonna animate him looking like this. It seems kind of crude, but he's also gonna flap his wings. He's gonna turn a little to the right just like in the original trailer as i told you i didn't want to waste time this video is already kind of long we'll go straight to the next scene which i told you about that i built in the garden trailer it shows a blue and pink scene where bitter giggle is sitting with his back turned and this is where i'm going to record him i created a very simple scene this was very quick to do i'll come here i'll select the character i have to record which is this bitter giggle but all in a strange color i'll stop here press to record with him he's gonna be sitting here in the corner of the wall about out here looking back seems like he's being punished sad i don't know but you can see that he's not very happy doing this i stop the recording and then i choose a place to position the camera i think the best place to position the camera here would be like this maybe turn a little i think this way it'll be a good camera after that in garden guys there's this other scene here which seems to be an old house with more rustic furniture here in minecraft it turned out like this i liked it a lot i also placed a bucket there this one also wasn't too much work because it's just a wooden house and these pieces of furniture Furniture I picked up here Look. are all models from Decacraft, various models that I already have. Here there's this door coming to the side, and already there's this other scene here. This one, yes, we need to do a recording.
recording, it was a bit more work because I had to do this with chisel and bits. The recording we have to do in it isn't so complicated. Now I take the normal bitter giggle and I stop where I think is here. Look, I stop here and I start recording with him walking. And then my character will be with the controller in his hand. He will be walking, looking there, looks back. Bitter giggle isn't following him. He runs back to the front, coming here to the next. Look at this. I created this scene here. It seems to be a calmer place. I don't know where it is because I haven't played the game yet. I only saw it in the trailer. But if I were to guess, it seems to be something related to the beach. Maybe Stinger Flynn's beach house. I don't know. It gave me a beach vibe. This coconut tree here. I don't know why. But it's very simple. Here, I just need to position a camera and add shaders later. The next scene after this one is inside in a room full of colorful towers. I honestly don't know how it's going to be inside the game. But it turned out really cool. And here in mine, I tried to recreate it as closely as possible. The only problem is that I won't be able to make these colored walls. Like barriers. This is going to be like an obstacle. You're going to be jumping. This is going to rotate. I won't be able to make it rotate. But it also turned out very beautiful. We're almost at the end of the trailer. Now there's a leaf maze with some lights on top. And this was the easiest to do. It was very simple because it's literally a brown square. A leaf circle. That's it. It was very easy. But also because in the game itself, we're just going to walk forward. There's no creature, no monster, or anything. The penultimate scene is when all the characters from Garden of Bam Bam appear here on the wall. The camera gets very close to Bam Bam and it pulls away until it can record all of them. And after that, finally, there's the scene where the mutant Nob Nob appears. You can see that he's literally the new monster of Garden of Bam Bam. So much so that he's in the thumbnail of the video. And yeah. He seems to be very strong. I just created a whole weird square. Because in the first place, it's going to be at night. With all dark light. And I'll come here in the corner and record with this nab nab. You can see that he's all different. This Look. one is mutant. And this one is normal. For you to see the difference. One has a mouth a thousand times bigger with all black eyes. But all right. Stay with the result of the Garden of Ban Ban 6 trailer inside Minecraft. Thanks. And if you watch the video up to here, comment this word that's appearing on the screen to know who is truly loyal. I'll give a little heart on your comments. Thanks.